Yo, what is up guys? So for today, we're going to be talking about Destiny 2. Now specifically, we're going to be looking at the Forbidden Visage armor, which is the Eververse armor. Uh, finally got all the pieces t this week, and I am I like it a lot. I'm a big fan of it. Uh, obviously, I'm doing it without the shader, so you guys can see how it just looks without it. Unfortunately, there are pieces of it that do not change color for whatever fucking reason. So the blue right here do not change color and the blue here and the white on the side does not change color i'll show you guys in a bit but let's look at each piece first i am a big fan of this actually let me show you how it looks without that let me see this one no let's do the, the other one this one so show you the helmet real quick i actually like it you can definitely do this it gives me like mandalorian vibes or like star wars vibes in general i like it a lot i'm a big fan of the helmet uh if i remember correctly it does shader pretty well as well so i think it shaders pretty well there's like that gold tint right there doesn't change color but that's not a big deal in my opinion mostly because it's really really small uh but yeah i think this looks really really fucking cool I'm a big fan of the helmet. When we get to the arms, I think the arms are probably the weakest portions of it. I am not a fan. I'm not going to lie to you guys. I think it's too bulky. It's way too fat. Especially when you like compare it to other pieces. Like if you have like a chest piece that doesn't come out so much, then it looks really weird. But it shaders okay. Like I said, the only unfortunate thing is this blue is constant. Like that blue is constant, right? Constantly there, and it's annoying. It's really annoying. It's unfortunate. I always say it, it's unfortunate when they don't let us change colors because it's like, bro, who hurt? Who's the person who keeps doing this? Who hurt you, bro? Stop it! Like this armor would be so fire if like I could change the whole thing color wise. Like it's, it annoys me. It's like such a, it's such a small thing, but it's like why bro why so again i actually am not the biggest fan of this chest piece so for me i don't really care that this doesn't change color because i don't like the chest piece already like i said that doesn't change color and it's unfortunate because it it could look cool i just, just again would not fuck with it and the fact that it doesn't change color there is also just a big a big negative the boots, however, I actually do like. I actually do like the boots a lot. I am definitely going to probably try to put it to something. You guys can see the different houses right here. If I remember correctly, those are different houses. Uh, this is, like I said, I like these boots. These boots are probably my favorite, if not my favorite, piece of this. Aside from maybe the chest. Or, I'm sorry. Aside from the helmet. I think the helmet's really cool as well. And then we get to the cloak, which, like I said... I like it don't get me wrong it looks cool i like the fact that it has like a neck guard plus this ornament ornamental shit it looks really cool it's just unfortunate that when you change the shader the blue stays the same and the white stays the same and it's just like bro like why why are you who who's the who's the person at bungie that just like immediately like oh no this part's you can't change the cutter color and it's like <sighs> it's unfortunate because like imagine Imagine the blue is actually tints to like this color right here, which is basically metallic. That'd be really cool. Like, again, it's just, it fucking sucks. And let me show you guys the the best shader for it, which is the Sato tribe. I think this is gonna be the best. Oof, hold on, let me, let me put the cloak back on. The Sato tribe uh, shader looks really cool with it. I mean, this is a shader that is from this armor's inspired season. So, like, it looks cool. I love it a lot. I definitely would probably rock the whole thing if I wanted to. But I'm definitely most likely going to switch out to, like, something with the boots. Obviously not all of this. I was going to I was gonna take off all the shaders, but then I was like, fuck that. I don't want to take all the shaders out. So... Most likely come out with something. Well, hold on, let me see. Backris, and then maybe like the ones I usually use. I still have to do the video of like my hunter, my titan, my warlock this season, which is definitely something I'm still gonna do. But yeah, let's go to the titan real quick. 
So the Titan is... I'm, so this is really weird. I think the Titan has probably some of the coolest pieces and some of the most terrible pieces. So obviously, let's start with the helmet. I think the helmet is probably one of the most terrible pieces of it. It's this part right here, honestly. It's the it's the top part. Like whoever designed this, I, that's a big nope dog. That it, it looks weird. Like maybe if it stopped right here and then came out from the side, then I I would be like, that looks really cool. And then maybe keep the horns up there. But like as of right now, it just looks fucking weird, bro. Like when I saw it, I was like, that looks fucking horrid, bro. Uh, obviously, this is to my taste. If you like it, then by all means, go pop off. But like, it, me personally, I don't like it. And obviously, this is, these videos are always very opinionated, unless you just want to see the armor itself. But like I said, the armor, just not a fan. Now, the arms, however, I am a big fan. I think the arms are really fucking cool. Uh, obviously, my character is a female, so it's not going to look super bulky. But I am a big fan of it. It's one of my favorites. The only unfortunate thing is that this this part does not change color. And it's it's unfortunate. I will always say it's just unfortunate. This also doesn't change color. This doesn't change color. It, like, bro, this doesn't change color. It's like, why, bro? Like, who, who hurt you, bro? Stop it. It would have been cool if we could change this as well. I'm just annoyed by it like honestly this is like it's it sucks too because like like i said this is one of my favorite uh pieces of this whole armor set but the fact that like this doesn't change color is just unfortunate and <sighs> this is destiny this is the game we play so chess piece i'm not the biggest fan of it uh i do like it more than others but there's something about it that I really don't like, uh, but I will say I do like the fact that the back piece actually goes all the way up here, which is like a main reason why I would even use this. But unfortunately, the blue doesn't change color. And again, unfortunate, like it fucking sucks. Like it really sucks donkey dick because I was like, yo, this looks really cool. Like. The, the back here, I'm a big fan of this. I think I've spoken about that previously, but I'm a big fan of Titan armor pieces that go all the way to like the back of your neck because that feels more Titan-y to me. And then you, you put some colors that I can't change and immediately kills it for me. I'm like, okay, cool. I'm never using this. Boots are also one of my favorite pieces, if not my favorite piece of this. I haven't seen how it shaders yet because I bought it and then I switched to my Warlock, but I am a big fan of it. If it shaders well, it's my favorite piece for the Titan ever, probably. So, fortunately, it changes everything. Again, gold trim doesn't change color, at least these two, but that's so small that I really don't care. Like, that would be so nitpicky of me to like bitch about, which is why I'm not. But it's really cool. I like this a lot. It's. Mm, I'm wondering if the blue here, or if this piece here is going to shade her well with, like, the whole thing. We'll see, obviously, but I'm liking... Mm, I don't like that. I don't like that. That looks weird. But I'm not going to lie. I, I love the piece itself. Ooh, that looks good. All right. And last but not least, we got the mark, which I'm not the biggest fan of. I am, um, again, so if you guys see any blue, then you immediately know it's not going to change color, which is very unfortunate. I don't like this, so I don't even give a fuck, to be quite honest. I only got it to complete the set, but on the off chance that one day they actually start changing their armor sets to not have any pieces that are uncolorable, then you might never know I might use this, but unfortunately, like I said, the blue does not change color. And to show you guys the best shader for it, in my opinion, it looks really cool. I Like I said, it's the, it's the helmet that's so fucking weird, but I think everything else is fine i think the mark is probably the weakest portion of it as well the helmet for me is just weird uh not even weak just weird but the mark is just a little too basic i would have loved it if it came down like all the way here to cover up the butt but whatever uh yeah let me know your thoughts in the comments below i not the dude it's unfortunate white 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 blue 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 it's like bro it's unfortunate like I would love to talk to the person who designs these and like 
make sure like what what sh what shaders what and be like why do you like just not let us change color sometimes like what's the deal like why is it like an artist thing because i get that but like still it's a whatever whatever so warlocks are next and not gonna lie guys yeah i'm not a, i'm not a fan i'm not a fan at all it's uh the helmet is okay and I'm being nice because I actually don't think it's okay. I think it's bad. But it does shader well, in my opinion. So if you do like it, then pop off. I think this is one of the better helmets as, as like shadering and whatnot. Although the other helmets did shader well as well. So that's not really saying much. But I'm trying to say something positive about this helmet because I am not the biggest fan of it. Uh, arms, honestly, on Warlock really doesn't matter. Although... If I remember correctly, this does shader well. Clips right there, and then I can't see the one down there. But yeah, arms are like whatever's, honestly. Warlocks probably already have a piece that they already like that they'll probably switch to. The chest piece, unfortunate, my guy, because obviously that blue does not change color. And it's like, why? Ooh, this doesn't even look good on it either. It's just like, why, dude? Like, why? Why go through all the hassle of making a cool looking armor to just have a piece that you can't change the color to and immediately just be like, okay, well, I guess I have to like cater towards this blue. I think the boots are probably the best boots we've seen, although it's not saying much. Like, I think they look cool. They definitely look cool. It's just that they're not, they're not anything crazy. They just look sleek and I like it. That's really it. And last but not least, the bond which i actually really do like because we don't have enough glowy uh stuff in the game in my opinion so if you want to do a whole glow look for your warlock you can definitely do it and yeah it looks really cool i think it's really cool so let's look at the shader which again it does not look oh well, it doesn't look bad but it's not like the best mostly because it doesn't have a lot of armor pieces if it had more armor pieces it would look a lot better but yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Uh, personally, if you were to ask me, I think the Hunter is one of my, my favorite, mostly because it has a lot more pieces that I actually do like and I would use. I think the Titan has, what, two pieces that I really do like, the arms and the legs. It's just unfortunate that the arms don't have, don't, don't, I have like three pieces on each side that don't change color and the boots don't like, don't have any of that. So those are the perfect ones. For the hunters, it's the same thing. The boots don't have anything that changes that you can't change the color of, which is great. And the warlocks, it's just unfortunate that your chest piece has this really long ass line of blue that doesn't change color. So yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you guys want to follow me on my social media outlets, links are in the description below. Thank you everyone for the support. I really do appreciate it. And other than that, I will see you guys later.